from a networking profile, you know, this is a whole bunch of stuff uh, that sh just talks about different systems that we have. I won't spend much time on it. But fundamentally, if it's digital communications, we've been in it or we will be in it or we are already in it. I talked about uh, uh, wireless communications. We've, we, we've done different types of wireless communications. Satellite we've talked about. And what we've been very proud about in 2008 was for the first time, we actually ended up putting into service a satellite which we owned ourselves. I want to spend a minute discussing that difference. The difference has been that there are major companies, many of them in this area, like Intelsat, that own a whole bunch of satellites, that we have been leasing capacity on the satellites to provide the services that we, we offer. For example, in 2008, on the cost side of our income statement, we ended up paying, uh, I think, close to $200 million of lease costs to the uh, fixed satellite service providers like Intelsat, like Americom, uh, Satmex, Utilsat, AsiaSat in, uh, in, uh, in China, uh, Insat in India, et cetera. So we've been leasing a lot of capacity. That, and if you look at the economics of leasing, these satellites, because of the huge amount of capital that it takes to put up a satellite, you find that these companies tend to make numbers like 75 to 80 percent gross margins or EBITDA margins, which, uh, which they need to make to pay for the return on that amount of capital that they're, uh, that they're deploying. So we looked at that and said there's an opportunity there. If we could launch our own satellites and start displacing this expense on our income statement, it'll allow us to significantly increase our own uh, EBITDA margins uh, and uh, uh, you know start looking more and more and improve our cash flow uh, significantly. So the first attempt at that was uh, Spaceway. And Spaceway is the world's first satellite which actually has a router or a switch on the satellite. Almost all communication satellites today that are in the commercial arena are bent pipes or what we call just reflectors. You send a signal to the satellite and it comes down in the location that you want it to come down. It doesn't do anything to the data or you know, in terms of routing it to a particular place or uh, improving its performance, et cetera. So in Spaceway, we built a satellite which, first of all, has a capacity which is said to be 10 gigabits, which is about five to eight times what the technology before this had. And two, it has a fancy bunch of features. I won't go into it. But fundamentally, it, it has changed the uh, technology in the satellite by a major step function, allowed uh, mesh connectivity, allowed routing, used a new piece of the spectrum or the airwaves called KA band. And for the first time, we went into commercial service in April 2008. And we at Hughes own this satellite. So on the cost side, the, uh, you know, this, the, the space segment, we're not paying that 80% margin to an FSS provider. And as we put more and more of our traffic on the satellite, and as we put up more and more satellites, you'll see the cash flow and the, uh, the percent margins of Hughes should start changing dramatically to look more like the model of a fixed satellite service provider. And that's why this is very exciting. And this is a 2008, uh, uh, 2008 milestone and something that uh, we've already put 150,000 subscribers uh, on it. And every month we are adding 15 to 20,000 uh, new subscribers on it. And our hope, uh, and uh, desire and dream is that we will, as we generate enough cash from this business in the United States, over the next five years, we'll repeat this model in other parts of the world. That's, we'll put up a satellite that will cover, uh, with, with about two to three more satellites, we'll be able to cover the whole world. And then we'll have our own, we'll be a fully integrated satellite service provider, not only in the United States, but in other regions of the world. And five years from now, that's where we'd like to be. Requires a lot of cash. Where's the banker? <laughs>